Willkommen! My name is Sean Huggins. I'm an American living in Germany and on this channel. I'm looking to learn all about life in Germany and Europe in general through watching silly videos and stuff on the internet with you guys. So, if you enjoy, consider subscribing. We got new videos every single day. And let's just hop straight into it. Today we're taking a look at some Germany fun facts, which should be interesting. Let's see if I can learn something or maybe we can learn something together. Guten Tag! I'm here to Hello. whisk you away on a virtual journey to Germany, oh boy. a country known for its rich history, vibrant culture, and fascinating facts. And beer. Are you ready for an adventure? <laughs> Let's dive right in. Let's do it. Let's start with a taste of Germany's world-renowned cuisine. Okay. Did you know that Germans are crazy about sausages? With over 1,500 different Versed. types of sausages, it's no wonder they have a sausage for every occasion. I actually just had a traditional Bavarian breakfast meal today for breakfast. Weisswurst Frühstück, which is white sausage breakfast. Yeah, it's awesome. I always love going to like the different festivals and stuff in Germany because they always have currywurst and bratwurst and stuff. And the worst is my favorite. I love it. From bratwurst to so currywurst. Tasty. Each region has its own specialty. Germany is home to many breathtaking castles. Wow, look at that. Neuschwanstein Castle, located in Bavaria. Schloss Neuschwanstein. Underwhelming. I did a vlog about it on my vlog channel. I'll link the video in the description. You can go check it out if you want. But this is a tourist trap, and I am sticking to that. Though it is cool to look at on the outside, you don't need to go into the inside. It's literally like five rooms. The tour is done in like 10 minutes, and it's not worth the money. But check out the vlog. Inspired Walt Disney's iconic I mean, very cool castle. looking, but still. It's no surprise that it attracts over 1.4 million visitors each wow. year it's i mean it looks so cool from the outside and it is very cool especially with the picturesque german alps in the background like that it's very cool but for me i like the real castles that were used as like defensive positions in war and battles and stuff like that i like that kind of stuff and this was just built for show this was built after castles were really necessary to protect a region and it was just for show and you kind of get that by how it's structured and also if you do the tour of the inside you notice that it's really just not a real castle it was built far later than castles were necessary and it's just not worth it in my opinion germans take their recycling seriously they have an impressive recycling system where citizens separate their waste into different colored bins mm -hmm. for paper, glass, plastic, and more. Yeah, I think it even goes more in depth than this in some places, but... Yeah, coming from America, I'm still trying to get used to sorting out all the different kinds of trash and where they all go and doing all that stuff. So it's a big adjustment, but... They're world yeah. champions when it comes to recycling. Football... Mm -hmm a.k.a. soccer, is a big deal in Germany. The national team has won the FIFA World Cup four times and the UEFA Very European impressive. Championship three times. Germans are passionate about their football. Mm -hmm. German is the second most widely spoken language in Europe. The second most widely spoken language in Europe. I guess that makes sense because Germany is the economic center of Europe. They're the economic power of Europe with the biggest economy and whatnot. So I guess people have to learn a lot of German so that they can do business in Germany. It makes sense. It's not only spoken in Germany, but also mm -hmm. in mm -hmm. Austria, Switzerland, mm -hmm. Luxembourg, and Liechtenstein. So, learning German yep, can open yep, yep. doors to various countries. But man, the German language has so many different dialects. Austrian German is different than, like, German German, and also Switzerland German is different than Austrian German, and it can get very confusing. So, I don't know how easy it is to just learn German, and then you're able to speak Swiss German or Austrian German, and then German German. I don't know what all the overlaps are with how difficult that is, but I know that there are some differences between the different German languages or Germany dialects. Germany is known for its efficiency and punctuality. Mm -hmm, they even mm -hmm. have a word for it, Fingerspitzengefühl, which means having a keen sense for details and getting things done 
with precision. Okay. Germany is famous for its technological innovations. Yeah, I know that Germany has like the third most amount of patents filed every year for like new inventions in the whole world or something like that. But the other countries are like America and China or something, which have crazy huge populations compared to Germany. And yeah, it's very impressive. It gave the world inventions such as the automobile. Well, thanks to Carl Benz, the printing press. Johannes Gutenberg, uh -huh. and Aspirin by Felix Hoffman. Ooh. Oktoberfest, held annually in Munich, is the world's largest beer festival. It attracts millions wow, of visitors that. who come to enjoy the traditional Bavarian... I went to Oktoberfest in Stuttgart, and it was huge and crazy and awesome and very fun. And yeah, it lives up to the hype. It was a very nice day. In beer, music, and food. Prost. <laughs> Berlin, the capital city, has a unique history. The Berlin mm. Wall, which divided the city for 28 years, was torn down in 1989, Whoa. leading to the reunification of Germany. Today, mm -hmm. remnants of the wall serve as a reminder of the city's past. Wow. Germans are known for their love of nature. And yeah. they have a whopping 130,000 kilometers of hiking trails that traverse breathtaking landscapes, mm -hmm. including the famous Black Forest and the Ooh. picturesque Bavarian Alps. I've been to the Bavarian Alps, and it was one of the best weekends of my entire life. I also have a vlog on that on my vlog channel. I'll link that in the description as well. The Bavarian Alps is one of the best places I've ever been in my entire life, and I can't recommend it enough. If you've never been there, you've just got to do it. Germany has you a strong to. tradition of classical music. Famous composers like Ludwig von Beethoven, Bach, Johann Sebastian Bach, Bach and Richard Wagner Bach. hailed from Germany. Their Richard music Wagner? still resonates around the world. Very nice. Germans have a fascination Ooh, with Christmas. The Christmas markets. Ooh, I love the Christmas Miss markets. markets. These festive markets pop up all over the country during all the holiday over. season, offering delicious food, mulled yeah. wine, and handcrafted gifts. That's the it's best. a magical experience. Mm -hmm. Germany is home to the Autobahn, a highway system with sections where there is no speed limit. Yeah. It's a paradise for car enthusiasts and adrenaline junkies who can legally zoom down the road. Mm-hmm. The iconic cuckoo clock originated in Germany's Black Forest region. What? The Dude, I didn't know that the cuckoo clock originated in the Black Forest. Its intricate timepieces are not only functional, but also works of art. Yeah, those things are really cool. With beautifully carved figures and the signature sound of the cuckoo. Dude, I think I need to go to the Black Forest. If any of you guys watching this video have been to the Black Forest and you know a specific place that I should go within the Black Forest, like an area or a little town or something like that, let me know in the comments because I know the Black Forest is a huge place. I need to figure out like a specific part of the Black Forest to go to, but I definitely need to check out the Black Forest while I'm here. German engineering is renowned worldwide. Yeah. German-made cars, yeah, yeah. such as Mercedes-Benz, yeah. BMW, and Volkswagen, Volkswagen. are synonymous mm -hmm, with mm -hmm. quality and precision. The phrase, made in Germany, is a stamp of excellence. Whew. We've covered just a fraction of the many fascinating facts about Germany. Very cool. From sausages to castles, innovation to nature, mm -hmm. Germany has something for everyone. Everyone. Thank you for watching. Or Thank you for watching. Wow, that was interesting. Yeah, I think my next move is to definitely check out the Black Forest. If anyone has any ideas or information or suggestions for visiting the Black Forest, let me know in the comments. But at any rate, that's all the time that I have for today. If you enjoyed this video, consider subscribing. We got new videos every single day. Check the links in the description for links to some of my vlogs or just check out my vlog channel in general along with my other social media accounts. Thank you guys so much for being here and as always, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Peace.